Welcome to this Principal Technologies webcast on CA Unified Infrastructure Management, or UIM. I'm John McMain, CEO of Principal Technologies. Here at PT, we do fact-based marketing and learning and development for nearly every kind of technology available today. Our teams do hands-on testing of the actual hardware and software products in our PT data center in Research Triangle Park, North Carolina. We then give you the facts we discover about the products. We also record every step in the testing and setup process and deliver them in complete methodologies so that anyone can repeat our tests and find the same results. Today, I want to talk about the importance of monitoring and management software. Enterprise and service provider IT environments are more complicated than ever before. Technologies are ever-changing, and there always seems to be a new problem to confront. You need an efficient and powerful solution to monitor and manage your data center, one that can adapt to your needs and give you clear, actionable intelligence on your infrastructure. The right monitoring and management solution can ensure compliance with service-level agreements, help you respond to issues and outages faster, and help your staff be aware of resource utilization issues and better plan for future growth. In this webcast, we're discussing some recent findings from our tests on CAUIM in some common scenarios. These scenarios are workflows that data center administrators and folks familiar with monitoring solutions deal with frequently. CAUIM is a software solution from CA that lets you quickly discover and monitor your infrastructure. It offers several methods and options for monitoring, including customizable reporting modules that don't require advanced programming skills. In our PT labs, we set out to explore the ways that CAUIM streamlined some workflows common to the everyday lives of infrastructure managers. We designed our hands-on testing so you can apply our results to your organization. If you have similar workflows or problems to solve, CAUIM may help your IT teams track how healthy your data center is and how to keep it that way. The results of our tests point to CAUIM being a solid choice for enterprises and service providers who need flexibility, reliability, and speed from their reporting and monitoring solution. To run our tests, we set up a small environment to fully evaluate how CAUIM worked. We used a combination of physical servers, storage, and networking devices. We then installed virtual machines for both the CAUIM software and some target VMs we could use for monitoring. Here, you see our layout. We used two dual socket rack servers to run our UIM solution. We installed VMware vSphere on these two nodes with external storage used to house the virtual machines. We installed Microsoft SQL Server 2012 on a dedicated Microsoft Windows Server 2012 VM for our database server and installed the UIM server on another dedicated VM. We used a third VM for both the Unified Management Portal and the Unified Reporter, two other components of CAUIM. We base our testing on a hypothetical business that needs to monitor a mix of enterprise-grade hardware and software solutions. Our targeted hardware for monitoring was the rest of what you see in this diagram. We wanted to test our use cases on a variety of targets, so we included a Cisco UCS chassis, EMC VNX storage, a Cisco Nexus switch, a Dell networking switch, and a Dell Equalogic iSCSI array. Our goal was to use real-life methods for our testing so our engineers created a series of real-world workflows that network and system administrators and their support staff might frequently use. We used CAUIM for each task and measured the time and step it took to complete those tasks. Specifically, we chose to study five scenarios, deploying CAUIM itself, monitoring different infrastructures, using the reporting tool set in UIM, discovering the multi-tenancy capabilities of UIM, and investigating enterprise monitoring coverage. Let's take a look at the results. The first thing we wanted to evaluate was the actual deployment and installation of UIM. We measured the time, complexity, and flexibility of the process. The installation was straightforward, and we found that the modular design of CAUIM made it quite flexible. You can install it on either physical hardware or virtual machines, and it involves multiple components that you can choose to place together or separately, depending on your environment. Let's run through the major components of UIM. The UIM server acts as the main hub, manager, and collector for the infrastructure. The management portal lets administrators discover, monitor, and view reports. A reporting server, the Unified Reporter, provides out-of-the-box reporting and report customization. The database server is the data repository for the solution. The secondary hubs are used in remote networks for access through a firewall. And finally, the Infrastructure Manager client is a full-featured application that helps you manage the entire monitor network. 
The various hubs of UIM act as central data repositories. From the hubs, you can deploy customizable robots out to the specific systems to collect information and return the results for collation and reporting. You then deploy probes to these robots, which define the collection parameters. You can configure the level of data collection that is right for your environment, which allows you to get all the information you want and, more importantly, only the information you want. All in all, it took us less than an hour to install our UIM solution, including installing and customizing the necessary Windows VMs, Microsoft SQL Server 2012 for the database, and all the UIM components. Licensing the solution was as simple as copy and paste. The next area we took a look at was monitoring. Monitoring means many different things to different people, and we couldn't test each and every use case. We therefore narrowed it down to common conceptual monitoring elements, discovery, working with agents and agentless technologies, and a ping monitoring workflow. Discovering devices can be extremely time intensive when technicians have to manually add each individual system. Automating system discovery saves you that time and frees you up for more critical tasks. Plus, automation ensures that your list of devices are always up to date and can help quickly discover unknown devices on your network. CAUIM offers a discovery wizard, part of the unified management portal, which walks you through defining credentials for each type of discovery that UIM supports. You can define credentials for SNMP, WMI, SSH, or Telnet. Using this tool, you can also schedule searches for new infrastructure and define the network scopes, ranges, or individual addresses that you want to include in your monitoring system. In our case study, the discovery of systems was both simple and fast. Another common element of monitoring solutions is the practice of using agents on the monitored targets. Agents are lightweight pieces of software that run within the systems you're monitoring and phone home with critical data. As mentioned, with CAUIM, you have the option of using these agents to collect data from your servers. In UIM, the agents are called robots. Configuring agent-based monitoring took us just over two and a half minutes. It took only a handful of steps and less than two minutes for us to deploy robots, both manually and automatically. That said, some organizations shy away from using monitoring agents on systems. In this case, they can use agentless monitoring technologies. UAM offers several methods of agentless monitoring, which also took just minutes for us to configure. One method uses the RSP probe, which collects data on Windows and Linux or Unix systems. Once it's deployed, monitoring new systems is fast and easy. To add a new system for monitoring, you just configure the probe by creating a new profile, designating the host name or IP address of the systems, selecting or defining new credentials, and choosing either WMI or SSH. We were able to deploy RSP in less than a minute and a half, and we added servers for monitoring in less than a minute. This approach works well for organizations that want to do monitoring across the environment without spending much time on configuration. Another agentless monitoring option is to deploy the SNMP collector probe, which collects SNMP information from network devices and from the server. To do this, we configured a template within the probe to collect metrics and then applied the template to the probe. Adding systems for monitoring was as simple as creating a new profile, designating a name, selecting the SNMP version to use, and providing the community name. We were able to deploy the SNMP collector probe and add systems for SNMP monitoring in less than four minutes. Adding systems to a probe took less than a minute. With this method, you do not have to provide domain credentials or Unix security credentials to your monitoring team. The final agentless monitoring approach we evaluated with CAUIM was to configure a ping monitoring test. To do this, we deployed the ICMP probe to a robot on a managed system. Once this was deployed, we did some quick configuration, adding profiles for each system we wanted to monitor. Then we simply had to restart the probe. We deployed the ICMP probe and configured a system from ping-only monitoring in less than a minute and a half. Adding systems only took 30 seconds. This type of monitoring works well if you need to know whether a system is up and running at any given moment. However, data isn't useful unless you can understand it, so the reporting tools in any monitoring solution are critical. CAUIM is no exception. CAUIM comes prepackaged with what CA calls unified reports. Unified reports are an easy way to get the information you need quickly for a range of predefined parameters. For maximum convenience, you can export unified reports to a variety of formats, including PDF, Excel spreadsheets, and more. If you need to see basic information on individual systems, UIM also lets you generate custom at-a-glance reports. 
To create one of these, just select one of your monitored systems and select At a Glance Report from the Reports menu. Then specify the time frame, the probe you want to use, and the delivery format. UIM will generate a report in PDF or Excel format showing basic information like CPU, disk, and memory utilization. These are useful when you need to track down problems because they visually show you the trends and patterns in your performance metrics. Every organization is different, though, and often you may want to customize your view of the report. With CAUIM, you can easily create custom reports. The interface lets you drag and drop monitored variables onto a graph, letting you review only the data in which you're interested. UAM's dashboards let you access at-a-glance statistics and visualize your data in a variety of ways so that you can look at your data however it makes the most sense to you. Service level agreement reports are also an important tool. They let you choose from the host of quality of service metrics available in CAUIM and use the resulting report to ensure your systems are meeting their SLA obligations. SLA reports help you determine whether you've already achieved compliance and if not, whether you need to make small or large changes. Everyone wants something different from their monitoring solutions. Instead of viewing reports and reacting to them, you might want your solution to alert you of problems so you can be more proactive. UIM can help. It lets you set custom alerts for when problems arise. Alerts and events are front and center in the unified management portal, so you don't have to worry about missing anything. UIM prioritizes alarms by default, but you can customize which alarms are most important. You can also act on your alarms with actions like acknowledgement, suppression, and assignment to users and tenant groups. If you're an assigned user, you can get alert notifications over email for ticket handling and problem resolution. Whether or not you're using alerts, dashboards are a huge asset in any monitoring solution. A dashboard is simply a visual collection of critical data where you can see the big picture at a glance. Unified dashboards in CAUIM allow you to visualize performance easily. They consolidate data and give you at-a-glance statistics. They consist of packages of automatically generated reports that pull data from your systems. If you need to save a particular dashboard visualization, just click the PDF icon. CAUIM can also help you build custom dashboards that show you only the data you want to see. With Dashboard Designer, you can click and drag elements onto a blank dashboard, arrange them into groups that make sense for your team, and publish the custom dashboard for the users who need access to it. CAUIM also supports multi-tenancy, a way to divide users into visibility groups based on what each user needs access to. If some administrators need to see monitoring data for every system, they can belong to one group, while users who need to view only one or two devices might belong in another. This is critical for efficiency and security purposes. Being able to divide users in this way means no user will be able to see data he or she isn't permitted to view. With CAUIM, you can organize users into accounts easily. That keeps users without permission from seeing the wrong data. Organizations can also be safely separated from one another with UIM. Within an account, administrators can grant users one of three default roles, each of which has a specific permission level assigned to it. The admin assigns custom reports, dashboards, and alerting to each specific account, letting different users access the information they need without allowing any user to access sensitive information from another account. The whole process of configuring these accounts is quick and simple. We configured a multi-user tenant in just a minute and a half. You already know that enterprise monitoring goes far beyond discovering devices and monitoring computer systems. It's more critical than ever to know that your applications are available and responsive. So we executed tests to find out how easily CAUIM could monitor your mission-critical applications. Specifically, our enterprise monitoring coverage tests included virtualization, Cisco UCS, website availability testing by managed node, OS process monitoring, and EMC VNX. Data center virtualization platforms like VMware vSphere give administrators a way to fully utilize and manage virtual infrastructure components. CAUIM can help you monitor those platforms, interfacing with virtualization management software to provide a single monitoring point for the entire virtual infrastructure. We use CAUIM to monitor our VMware infrastructure with a dedicated probe deployed to a robot handling remote data collection for VMware vCenter server. It took us less than two minutes to configure this enterprise monitoring coverage for vSphere. Cisco UCS, a leading hardware solution that encompasses servers and networking, provides an application framework to manage converged infrastructure and software-defined hardware profiles. It can help administrators provision or repurpose servers quickly, and like all parts of your infrastructure, it's useful to be able to monitor it. 
CAUIM can directly interface with and monitor Cisco UCS, meaning that IT staff can save time on monitoring. CAUIM uses a Cisco UCS probe, which we deployed and configured in just under two minutes. Of course, enterprise storage failures can result in major outages, and you need to avoid them at all costs. We looked at storage monitoring on the EMC VNX storage array in our environment. UIM can monitor enterprise storage array like the EMC VNX 5500 and notify administrators of availability, usage, and capacity issues. In this case, we deployed the Clarion probe to a robot in the environment in which the EMC Navisphere command line interface was installed. Then UIM directly communicated with the EMC storage processors and collected data. We were able to configure EMC storage monitoring in just over a minute and a half. UIM can also monitor individual processes on specific systems, provide alerts and information, and carry out management tasks like restarting interrupted services or processes. This can be especially useful if you have a critical process running and you need to know if it's having problems. To test process monitoring, we opened an application on a monitored target and started it and stopped it. We then deployed a robot and configured its probe to monitor the application. We configured this OS process monitoring in less than a minute. In the screenshot, you can see the alert we received when the process exited. In addition to monitoring OS processes and the virtualization hardware and storage platforms I mentioned earlier, CAUIM supports website availability monitoring. With more and more consumers online, enterprises have to be aware of availability issues with web-based systems. CAUIM can monitor website availability using probes installed on robots that check remote sites. We configured the URL response probe in less than a minute and a half. Website availability monitoring keeps you on top of your customer-facing web services and ensures that your customers can engage with your business whenever they need to. No matter what work your organization does, it's critical to monitor your infrastructure, applications, and web availability. If any part of your system fails or isn't working correctly, you could face some significant consequences, ranging from contending with angry end users to actually losing money. To maintain a strong, functional infrastructure, you need a monitoring solution that's effective and easy to use. In our hands-on testing, CA Unified Infrastructure Management streamlined configuration and workflows in executing management tasks. Simply put, it was flexible, fast, and easy to use. CA UIM can provide flexibility and performance for large enterprises seeking the right monitoring and reporting tools. Thanks for watching this webcast. For all the details on CA Unified Infrastructure Management, go to the website listed above.